I think it's a start of a revolution. The Jewish General Hospital hosted its first ever surgical robotics conference. It was an opportunity for experts to measure the impact of this recent technology in the operating room. Welcome to this conference that promises to take a frank and compelling look at the current state of robotic surgery. It's really taking surgery out of the hands of the surgeon by putting that computer in between us and the patients, which allows us to get so much more information, to be so much more precise, and to be able to do personalized type of care for each patient. Robotic assisted surgery allows the surgeon to use a computer to control a robot to perform the surgery. It's rare that we can learn something completely new in our lifetime, you know? So we've learned something in our residency, but now all of a sudden it's a brand new technique. It, it gives us technology to uh, perform surgery in a way that we were not able to perform it even five years ago. When I'm using the robot, I have a camera that's millimeters from the tissue inside the human body. I can actually dissect out nerves, so I'm sparing people's nerves. Certainly, I think we have to convey to the government the importance of robotic surgery. It's, it's, it's modern medicine in its finest. There's no doubt that surgical robotics is the way of the future. And the smaller this technology gets, the more it could be used in a wider number of procedures. For West Central Report, I'm Cal Thériault.